y'all. So, <laughs> I noticed while editing <laughs> that this video doesn't have an intro. <laughs> so, y'all might get one of these real, um, All right, anyway. Hey there, YouTubers. It's your girl, Nayla Toy, and I'm back with another video. Hey, so today's video is going to be on this green machine look. Y'all gonna have to watch the video to see the look because <laughs> I forgot to record an intro and didn't even realize I didn't record an intro until I'm in the midst of editing. And I'm like, oh, girl, you ain't no intro. <laughs> Ooh, this YouTube life is too much. It's too much for you, girl. It's too much. Anyway, go ahead and keep on watching to check out my green machine. All right, everybody. So let's get into this look. <laughs> All right. So base is done. Brows are done. Let's get right into this eyeshadow. So today I'm going to be using the oh so uh what do you call it i don't freaking know but the subculture palette <laughs> so i'm actually deciding to do a green look so i'm gonna go in with destiny uh untamed and axis cube on the lid so that's the order Let's get it right into it. Gonna go in with first blending brush. Go in with Destiny first. It's like an olivey green. Of course, I'm going to put it above the crease and blend it out. Put it a little too deep on this side, so it's going to take a little bit more blending. A little bit more blending, child. But that's okay. Untamed right in the crease. Go back in with the brush I started with and blend it with that olive -ear, olive green color on it. Blend it together. And then I'm gonna go in with Axis. Axis, I'm gonna take more of like an eyeshadow brush to blend it on the outer V. To the crease. Now this color you want to be directly in the crease. So put your brush this way and blend in. And on the lid. So not have this so far blown out, you go back in that olive green color 
that more fluffy blending brush and blend it so it's not so there's no difference in your transitions all right so that looks good same on the other side take excess place it where you want it to go take it up into the crease same thing here I'm going to take your fluffy blending brush and blow it out to make sure everything is blended then I'm going to go in with cube now I'm going to need to lay down a little bit more concealer because I want cube to really show all in here but we're not cutting the crease no cut crease just lay down a little more concealer and do the same over here I'm actually gonna go in with cube with my finger because cube is like an iridescent pink I want to make sure it shows up. So I'm going to lay it down first with my finger. And then I'm going to go in with the brush and lay a little more on top. The brush I'm going to use is a tapered eyeshadow brush. I really like that color. It's really pretty. Again, going with my finger on the other side. And I'm good there. So I'm gonna go in with that deeper color again. Um, this time on a small blender so that I can blend it in. Deepen it up a little bit. Because I feel like when I blend, I lose a little bit of my depth in the outer V. <laughs> so you can always go back in to deepen up your outer color. I'm going to do Untamed in my lower lash line so that it gets directly here. clean up my eyes and I'll come back and we'll do the lip what was it <laughs> I'm back let's get into the lip y'all gonna go with motives pink champagne let's see how it looks
<laughs> that does it for me. <laughs> so again, that lippy is Motives Pink Champagne. And that's all we got, y'all. So, y'all already know which girl right at. Go ahead and subscribe. Hurry up. Go ahead, click the button. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Go ahead, go ahead. It's right there. <laughs> go ahead and subscribe to your girl's channel. Like and comment down below what other looks you would like me to attempt. <laughs> if there's a specific color you are looking for me to do on my skin tone, please let me know down in the comment section below. Until next time, catch you guys later.